Changes in quality of life can so often happen very gradually and subtly that we just don't see it. We see our loved ones so often that symptoms go undetected often for a long period of time or until they become a, like a big significant problem. We want everyone to be aware that the loved ones they are assisting in their home can have these issues. It is something our case managers see all the time when we're there in the homes helping with home care. This resource page is focused on acupuncture and we asked Kathleen Keneally of Keneally Acupuncture to help with identifying some of the things we should look for in our loved ones as signs that there might be an issue. The kind of things that I think that people don't, that are kind of signs or telltale signs that you may or may not notice is just um, the, the lack of memory, you know, people repeating themselves, um, maybe noticing slight tremors in the hands. Um, again, these are things that are so subtle sometimes that we don't notice, but all these can point to some neurological things. And acupuncture is very good, for, again, for increasing blood flow, working on the balance and so on. Um, what else kind of things that people, I mean, just general things that we just get used to seeing people function, but I think those are the cognitive things. Again, physically, if people are having, noticing that they're having more difficulty with their balance, um, not picking their feet up you know, walking, um, shuffling, things like that. Again, those are subtle changes that we may or may not notice if we just get used to helping people, you know, put their shoes on or whatever the case is. So I think the motor skills part also is something um, that is really, and then also um, when, when you notice that they're getting frustrated easily, irritated easily, things like that. That just, you know, again, just general frustration because they're not able to do as much. Again, acupuncture can treat that in terms of just helping them relax more.